Want to learn how to quickly and easily create a landscape for your designs? Look no further. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how easy it is to do that. Hello there, Stephanie here from My Prince Collection, the place where I share the best ways to use the Procreate app so that you can make money online. This is one of the tutorials of my uh, Halloween Gnome series for Procreate. In the previous tutorial, I shared how to use the automatic selection tool so that you can quickly and easily color your designs. If you haven't and would like to watch the previous tutorial, a link will be in the description below. Let's create a quick and easy landscape illustration that you can incorporate into your designs. Let's open the Procreate app. I'm using a screen size canvas, so you can click on the plus sign, select a new canvas. I'm gonna go with the screen size. I already have this nice blue, but we are gonna change it. So first of all, to create this landscape, I'm gonna add one layer and I'm gonna start drawing like this. Tap, hold and drag to fill with this color. Now I'm gonna select another color. By the way, I'm using the Terracotta um, color palette. This palette is available in the shop. Also is one of the palettes of my bundle um, with 160 or 50 uh, color palettes that you can get. So now I'm gonna select a darker blue. Let's go with this one. And underneath the layer that we've created, I'm gonna add a new layer and repeat the process. Select, hold and drag. Add a new one, a new layer, select a lighter blue. Like this. And I'm gonna add another layer and select a lighter blue right. and repeat the process to kind of create those mountains behind again I'm gonna add another layer let's create some um, landscape like this so what I need I need to make sure that I close the gap here select drag and drop Add a new layer, change to a lighter green, like this one. Make sure that I close the gap. And I think I'm gonna do one more. And we are good to go. This is a quick landscape. Now I'm gonna create a nice uh, sunset. So to do that, I'm going to add a new layer at the bottom of all my layers. I'm actually going to tap hold so you'll see only what I'm doing um, on this layer. I'm going to select a soft brush. You can use any brush for this. And with the same uh, color palette, I'm going to go from a darker color to a lighter color and just increase the size of my brush like this and paint it like this select another color like this one create this nice ombre effect and now that i have this um my canvas painted i'm gonna go to the adjustments caution blur and blur this a little bit to have a more seamless a gradient effect I'm gonna turn all my layers on again. And as you can see, you have this nice ombre effect. I'm gonna create a sun. So um, between my, um, my sky background and all these layers, I'm gonna add a new layer and I'm gonna select a yellow tone. Let's go with this one and select the technical pen. I'm gonna draw a circle hold to make a perfect circle with your fingers tap and we'll create a perfect circle gonna select it and just move it just the right way and increase the size if i want to so i'm happy this to be here i'm gonna drag drop and uh drop the color now i'm gonna place it over here now i want to create some effect so i'm gonna duplicate this layer 
and turn the opacity to 80%. And now with the selection tool selected uniform, I'm going to increase the size. And just to make this nice effect over here, I'm going to repeat the process, the one underneath. Now I'm going to change the opacity to 60% like this. Select, increase the size of like this. Okay, I'm happy with it. And I'm going to add another one. This time I'm going to decrease the, the opacity to 40%. Okay, I'm going to select the tool, increase the size, place it like this. And I think I'm going to do one more with a 20% opacity. Like this, selection tool, increase the size and place it like this. So now that I'm happy with the background that I've created, I want to add my GNOME. So I'm going to go to my layers at the very top of the layers that we've created. I'm going to add a new one, a new layer and go to my uh, brush set and select uh, a gnome, change to a darker color and stamp the gnome and place it. And there you go. We've created a quick and easy landscape tutorial. And we are done. We have created a quick and easy illustration that you can take inspiration from and add into your creations, your designs. In the next tutorial of this series, we are going to learn how to create an embossed Halloween gnome effect. If you like the free uh, Halloween gnome stamp, make sure to check out the full Halloween gnome set for Procreate. The links will be in the description below. Thank you so much for watching and until the next video, happy drills and illustrations.